mixers are used in live broadcast environments, streaming, houses of worship, festivals, esports, and so much more. Having the ability to show different angles or scenes gives your production much more choice when it comes to how you wish to present to your audience. Mixers can also be used to raise the production value of any live event by adding effects, graphics and picture in picture. Each mixer will feature a variety of different inputs and outputs and will also support specific formats. The most common connections you'll see are SDI and HDMI as these are standards within live production environments. You'll also find common professional audio connections like XLR and quarter inch TRS jacks so that you can take an output from an audio mixing console and combine your audio and video. Some mixers even feature scalers and converters on their inputs to allow you to mix resolutions and frame rates from different sources. Because there's nothing worse than getting to an event to find out there's a laptop or a camera that you just can't use. Whilst the core functionality of switching is the same, each switcher will also support different features like media pools, digital video effects, also known as DVEs, and keys. There's also the question of form factor. Are you going to need an all-in-one unit for being out in the field, or are you going to be mounting your switcher in a rack and pairing it with a large control console that's in a studio? Regardless of your needs, SCAN has a switcher for you. A common function of mixers is known as keying, which lets you cut or key out part of your image. This resulting transparency allows you to layer up different images. A good example of this would be chroma keying, whereby you select a specific colour to be keyed out. This is widely used in studios for placing your talent in front of backgrounds or within virtual environments. You also have the ability to tie chroma keys and other effects to transitions, so that when you switch between cameras, you can seamlessly add or remove a key or effect. This makes switching between talent shot on a green screen and a reporter out in the field as easy as pressing a button. A DVE or digital video effect can include resizing, moving or rotating a video input. This makes picture in picture a breeze. Layering up videos in different positions creates the opportunity to have multiple sources interact, with a good example of this being reporters and news anchors both on screen simultaneously. With both upstream and downstream keys, you can layer videos up and place bugs, stings and graphics over your image immediately before playout. Multiviewers allow you to see each incoming signal as well as your program and preview signals. This allows you to make a quick decision on what you want to show. The program view is the signal that's currently being sent out of the main output on the unit, whilst the preview is the signal that you've lined up to cut to. Whilst not a necessity, control panels, or hardware surfaces, allow for simpler and quicker control of the switcher. As anyone who's ever been in a live environment knows, having everything at your fingertips takes the stress and confusion out of finding things within control software, allowing you to keep your focus on exactly what's happening. Some control panels actually have the switcher built into them for an all-in-one unit like the Wirecast Gear 320 or the Data Video HS2850. Control surfaces give you all of the functionality of switching, including buttons for program, preview, DVEs and transitions, and even a T-bar for controlling those transitions. An important part of driving a live production is the ability to have your producer speak with your operators. With a range of talkback solutions, your producer can feed instructions to the camera operators, mixers and everyone behind the scenes. One of the most important parts of interfacing talkback devices with switchers is whether they are a two-wire or a four-wire solution. In two-wire systems, also referred to as party line systems, they have both transmit and receive on two wires. These can be two-wire unbalanced or two-wire balanced. The simplicity of this design allows for anyone on the line to listen and talk to anyone else. Four-wire talkback systems use different pairs for transmit and receive. This uses either four-wire balanced or four-wire unbalanced connections. This type of system allows for more direct communication, allowing for the producer to talk to or listen to a specific operator. Tally is a way to communicate which camera is live or on your program output at any given time. A red light often atop the camera indicates to the camera person and the talent they are live, whilst the button that corresponds to that camera on the mixer 
will illuminate red to give the vision mixer a quick indication. The uptake of live streaming has led to the inclusion of streaming capabilities within the latest live production mixers. New offerings from manufacturers like Blackmagic Design and Roland now include USB outputs that send your program output ready to be streamed immediately. This lets you reach a much wider audience on platforms like YouTube and Facebook Live. If dedicated mixers and switchers are beyond your production's needs, you can always look at software-based solutions. Using a basic I.O. device, like the Blackmagic Design DeckLink Quad 2, you can take up to 8 SDI inputs into your computer and use a software-based solution. Solutions from Wirecast allow you to mix and stream without the need for a bulky hardware panel. I hope this has helped you understand a bit more about switchers, mixers and generally live production. If you have any more questions, please don't hesitate to contact the ScanPro video team.